you can count on that for sure. So both choices available and it's a perfect place to house things like a bread maker <laughs> that you know, maybe you'll pull it out every once in a while, but I'm telling you, Wolfgang's bread maker will rock your world. Not only is it gonna provide you with two, the two pound uh, loaf of fresh bread, there's nothing better than that smell. Walking into a home, are you kidding me? It's the smell of love. It we is. all see it, you know, you smell it when you go mm. to your favorite bakery, but when you smell it in your own home, you can have the worst day ever and it just smells like someone loves you. <laughs> no, just get some butter and everything is good from there. So I love this bread maker because first of all, it makes it super mm -hmm. easy. You can't mess it up. You can choose from three different settings for the yes. crust. It comes with a variety of recipes. So let's talk about all the kinds of bread you can make. Oh my gosh. Well, ah. starting with gluten-free because that's where Wolfgang said, I've got to make something for people at home because he noticed in the restaurant that people were asking for gluten-free food and there really wasn't anything great on the market. And then he had his son, Oliver. And Oliver does so much better in all ways really? when he doesn't consume gluten. And Wolfgang was so shocked by what was on the market. He says, there's got to be a better way. I don't want to just have to go to the market. I want to be able to make it at home. I want it to be made when I come downstairs to have my espresso. What in the world can we do? I don't want it to take up a ton of room. And so he designed a bread maker that has a built-in gluten-free function. Gluten-free baking for bread is very different from traditional. Yep. Just as delicious, but very, very different. So he added that feature to it. So it'll make all kinds of things. But here's the thing. If you can read a recipe, dump the ingredients in this pan, you can make homemade bread. There you go. And I know we've got one of your cookbooks available as well as the recipes that come along with the machine. Um, let's see, I know that there's like, I saw the list of all the delicious, what kind of bread are you gonna make first? This is a gluten-free one. I just oh, wanted to, and they're, they're actually Great. the same process, but I'll show you on this one. But many different settings. So if it's a, like a basic white bread, you would choose the setting of basic. French usually has four ingredients, water, salt, yeast, um, and water. And then the whole wheat one takes the longest because of the heavy grains. Quick means it's gonna make something like banana bread that's considered a quick bread. Or you can do sweet, which is something like maybe cinnamon rolls. Gluten-free, which is setting number six. Rapid bakes, which just bakes everything in less than an hour. Dough, so you can just have it mix and proof dough for you, like pizza dough or something like that. Jam, I adore it. You can make homemade jam That's in it, right. of course. Cake <gasps> means forgot. just what it says. Sandwich bread, and then straight up bake. So if you wanted to mix up a meatloaf, drop it in here. Press bake, and it'll do all of that for you. And then it's nice enough to go to keep warm when it's done. I know, it keeps it warm for an hour. Mm -hmm. Plus there's a 13 hour delay yes. function. So just like your coffee maker, right? Program it before you go to bed. Yes, you wake up to the smell of fresh bread in the morning. And I love, first of all, I mean, I, I, when you make it yourself, you know, you can control how much sodium, how much sugar, what the ingredients are, whether it's gluten or not. That is the beautiful thing. Because if you, please, if you've ever looked at the ingredient deck on a loaf of bread in the grocery stores, the reason they last for three weeks in your drawer is because they're so full of chemicals yes. and preservatives and things you cannot even begin to pronounce. It's horrifying to me. It really is, and to be able to make things fresh, you know it's the best thing for you and your family. So we just close the close it up, touch a button. And so we're gonna go down to setting number six, which is gluten-free. It's a little hard for me to see. You'll have a harder time. Then after you've selected which one you're using, you're gonna go to the color. That means the color of the loaf. If Wolfgang was here, he would say, make it darker, because he only likes to have dark, but you're gonna choose medium or dark or light. And then you're gonna choose the life si loaf size. Is it smaller or is it larger? Hit start and the machine takes over from there. It starts to mix it nice and slow, as you can see. See how the paddle's just turning in quarter turns at first? The reason it's doing that is so that it doesn't fling flour all over the inside of the machine. But it's so cool, it's gonna mix it, it's gonna rest it, it's gonna proof it. That means where it gets nice and big and full of air, then it's mm. gonna bake it and go to keep warm. So literally, you walk away, you throw the ingredients in, close it up, press that, button and walk away. And then if you want things in the bread, like maybe you want um, candies or nuts yes. or raisins or sun-dried tomatoes or something like that, what you're going to do, oops, I've got that up. You're going to add it to this little hopper that's right here. And what it's going to do is dispense whatever you put in here at the right time so that the pieces don't get too small. Oh, I just dropped it open again. So in this case, we're going to add pecans. I just did it again, Callie. Don't <laughs> pay okay. attention to me. Yeah. <laughs> so add your pecans here, or whatever it is, close it, and the machine knows automatically when to dispense them. So that's all there is to it. It's small, compact, but it is amazing. I am telling you, and by the way, I don't have it out here, but there's a recipe book that comes with your machine. And it, you, you get recipes oh, this like. Little guy. Mm -hmm. There it is. 
Liz, thank you so much. I'm blind as a bat. No, today. I, I hid it from you. It's but not your fault. Everything from your all-American favorite white to banana bread to your chocolate pound cake. To, it gives you all the instructions as to how to use this. It couldn't be easier. Wolfgang wants it to be one touch and go. That's how he likes to do it. So why wouldn't he want that for you? But creamy, cheesy pound cake and fast focaccia is in it recipe in here. You even get Wolfgang's famous pizza uh -huh, dough recipe. And it's amazing. So this is a little bit of gold. I highly recommend. You know what? This is the price too that we we, we won't do again. I think this is the time of the year when the summer, you know, kids are going to be out of school for in a couple of weeks in most parts of the country to be able to have that home baked bread. What is more of a memory that for, for any of us than, like for me, it was my grandma. Like I'd come to the farm and it was like, oh, I'm home. <laughs> that smell is just so familiar. And like you said, it is the smell of love. It and is. when you can do it at home, it costs less. It's so much healthier for you and for your family. And I know you're gonna enjoy it a whole lot more. You will. And you know, it's actually when, we, when Wolfgang asked me to move to um, HSN full time, we had to sell our home in Orlando. And let me tell you, this was not a pretty house. And <laughs> Uh, all we did was, he, thank goodness he'd sent the bread maker, made bread every time we were scheduled to have it, people come visit the house. <laughs> it sold the first day, Callie, and did I'm that? convinced that if it looked a little deeper. I think the smell, we yes. put some flowers by the front door, painted it red, and then put the bread maker in there. I really, truly do. I think when you smell that lovely smell, we For all sure. know what it's going to taste like, but it just draws you in like a beautiful song that you remember. It's so, so, it really does work. It's so true. And here's what I love the most about bread making. My grandmother used to spend hours prepping and kneading and mm. punching and letting it rise and sitting and waiting and the towel over and put it in a warm spot. This is so easy. It literally programs. It knows when to rest. It knows when to stir. It knows when to blend in the yeast and how fast. It takes all the work away and all the enjoyment is just waiting for you. That whose mouth is not watering right now, I ask you? And this, so mm. this is that same gluten-free bread in about three hours. I think you can hear it beside wow. me. The machine Steaming. is now going um, full speed. So imagine, come up here with me. Mm. There's our dough. And this is what you get three hours later. It's hot, it's steamy, it's soft, it smells amazing. And this can be any kind of bread that you love. Whatever your favorite one is, maybe it's pumpernickel, maybe it's cinnamon raisin. It's as easy as adding the ingredients to the pan, follow the recipe, dump them into that pan, press the buttons that are appropriate for that pan, walk away, and this is what you get. It doesn't have to be Difficult and you know so many of you say I can't do yeast. Here's why mm. you didn't have the machine that could do the mixing and you didn't have the right oven to do it But when you have Wolfgang's bread maker if you can add the ingredients to it You're going to be baking beautiful bread just like this and that's all you do is you put the ingredients here It comes. I mean this is the size of loaf that you can pull out. Is that? Brownie? Brownie. Of That's course brownie? it does brownies. And people are always blown away by that, Callie. Mm. But brownies are in the quick bread family, the same as like banana bread. Really? Yeah. And you just add, it can be from a mix or it can be homemade. And it, this, it's as good as it gets. And you know what? Watch the butter melt on this bread mm -hmm. and imagine yourself in a week. Because if you order this today, this is you next week. Having this beautiful bread with your family. This is one of those. Having your home smell like this. And you can make that homemade jam too. In the bread maker. Oh, that looks yeah. incredible. Jams are always four ingredients, the fruit, sugar, pectin, and usually lemon juice. Press the jam setting and in an hour and 20 minutes. Get out a pretty jar, start putting it in, and you've got gifts to give. So gifts after gifts to give. Are you telling me I wouldn't have to go through the whole like pressure cooker process of making jams nope. anymore? <laughs> Can you imagine the freedom of your time and the stress of all of that and all the extra, uh, that is amazing. You put all the ingredients and you can make your jet fresh jellies and jams, brownies and cakes, and something's beeping. Oh, it just means it's done. We've got more breads that we need to get cutting. Lemon curd, cherry jam. Oh, this is gonna be a fun summer. If you love, you know, to go to those fresh, those uh, farmer's markets and stock up on the freshest produce of the season in your area, to make jams and then spread that on your home-baked bread. It smells so heavenly in here. <laughs> I wish we could just convey that into your living rooms. It's such a treat. That, okay, that's two of the other breads that are that we made ahead of time. There's a cinnamon raisin, and I think it's 100% whole wheat. <gasps> yeah, cinnamon raisin just got finished. And then I think this is whole wheat, I'm not sure. Oh my gosh, that smells so good. I know, right? We have so many breads in here, so Callie. So good. How about buns? Can I make, just make a dough and then bake Absolutely. them in the oven? Absolutely. Use the dough setting, okay. then take that dough out. You, if you want to make cinnamon buns, you would spread it out, do the cinnamon, the butter, the sugar, mm. roll it up, cut it traditionally, or you could cut it, put it back in the, pan, the loaf pan and let it bake. 
so you're not heating up your whole house. It's really easy and it's convenient and fun. What a great point you make. This is so fun when your kids hours. or grandkids come over or you have that time where you want to play, you want to cook together, but you just don't have time for it to be all day. And the brownies that this thing makes, oh my gosh, you're gonna choose the quick setting and you're gonna just dump the ingredients in all on top of each other. You're not gonna worry about creaming butter and sugar first. Really? Yes, you're just gonna oh. add it all together. Wow. And look what you get. And isn't this what we want? A brownie that's dense and oh. thick and chewy. And mm -hmm. see how it has pecans? Mm -hmm. We added the pecans <laughs> to the nut dispenser and it put them in at exactly the right time so they stay all nice and big pieces. Oh, that looks amazing. This can be you in a week and it's so easy. And honestly, it's really great even from a mix. It turns out exactly the same. Dump the mix in, press the button, and this is you. So did you hear what she said? You don't have to cream the sugar no. and the butter together anymore. That was always the hardest part for me. I've never been a great cook. I've been a pretty good baker, but things like that, oh, Oh, forget it. I just end up not doing it from scratch anymore and go to the box version, which is fine. But I think we all know the benefits of making things from scratch. You know what ingredients are in there, what aren't. You know what your family likes and what they prefer. And I love the fact that it doesn't take any extra time. In fact, it is less time to make right? anything from bread to brownies and in between in a bread maker than it does to, to do it any other way. And if it's a birthday, don't stress about it. Don't order a really expensive cake. I adore brownies for my birthday but if you're like me and you struggle with your weight less is more you don't need a gigantic cake make the small batch of brownies mm -hmm. give Marion this brownie like this Wolfgang too he would be so happy with this do a little smear of icing on top so that a it little feels candle. special a little candle in fact can you steal one of those candles for me yes. Valley? and look at how sweet this can be so not a, you're not heating up your big oven you're not having to have it be a complicated all day process. It's sweet, it's cute, you can do this. And with Wolfgang Puck in your kitchen, it's a breeze. Wait, and don't forget, you get a lot of great recipes included. So you, you're not left to your own accord. You get recipes, you get instructions, not that you need them because it's so intuitive. It's literally one touch based on the type of bread that you're interested in. There's three different crust settings. So if you like a nice crusty exterior, you can do that, depending on the kind of bread that you're doing. I mean, whether it's a challah or a pumpernickel or look at some of these like Kaiser rolls and like, what's this one over here with that? A Just nice a wreath, twist. yeah. With, oh. with like a seven grain and a plain one, braid them together. Cause remember it'll make the dough. So you're going to have fun playing with it. So this, all these breads were made in this machine, you Absolutely. guys. You can really, look at this one, looks incredible. Is this just like, like whole it's, wheat or it's 12 grains? It's actually Wolfgang seven grain seven bread. Grain. And he's really famous for it. it was, it's was it been in several of his restaurants and his bread service at his restaurants has it now. But healthy, delicious, chewy, toothsome, mm -hmm. but not at all too bird seedy where you're like, oh my gosh, that was too healthy. <laughs> kind of the opposite. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's a good one. That's what there's, he calls it. There's a lot of jam recipes in here too. Don't forget, you get Wolf's pizza dough, the famous pizza bro dough. You get the famous gluten-free bread, French bread, cinnamon raisin, cream cheese, pound cake, chocolate pound cake I mean you guys and then sky's the limit from there once you do a low for two you're gonna be such a pro you'll just you won't even refer to the guide look at that how did you do Isn't that? Isn't that beautiful? So this is a sweet dough because it's a, basically a cinnamon roll that we rolled up. We mixed it first on the dough setting. Took it out. Remember you were talking about cinnamon rolls? Yes. Padded it out and just to a, a rough, rough rectangle about the size of a piece of um, sheet of paper. Then put the cinnamon, sugar, pecans, raisins on top. Rolled it up, you know, cinnamon bun fashion, yeah. put it back in the pan, let it proof, and bake it on the bake setting. Mm -hmm. And here's the thing, you don't have to do all of that, but here's Yum. what you're going to find. Because it does all the work for you, you're going to want to get in there and play with it. At least <laughs> I do, because it makes it so darn easy. Well, and like I said before, I mean, with Wolfgang's Bread Maker, it does all of it. It knows when to rest, when to proof, when to do what, you know, my grandmother used to do by hand, and it was an amazing experience for us as grandchildren, but I know she spent the better portion of every morning making something fresh and delicious. This can do the job for you, and it still smells as good as grandma's homemade bread. I'm Who telling you what, and it'll taste probably better. So here's the deal, guys. This is $30 less right now in this show. It's the only scheduled airing at $30 off, plus there's free shipping. So that's $40 that you get to save. And you're only putting in, if you want to use a FlexPay, it's $19.99. To get it home, 
try it. You've got a month. If you don't love it, you can send it back. I know you're going to love it and wish you would have gotten it a long time ago, but you'll be glad you didn't because you get to save $30 by getting it today instead. So it's item 288613. I point all that out because we don't even have well, we've got, we're hovering around a thousand of these available. And if that sounds like a lot, we sell tons and tons of these just sitting on our website every single day of the week, even when Wolfgang isn't here at the regular price. So enjoy the best, the special price. And oh, that looks like it might be my favorite bread of the day. Oh my goodness. What is it called? The molasses whole wheat. Yes. And it's hundred percent whole wheat. So Yum. it's so yummy and good for you. But look at this tall, handsome loaf. Yes. If you are trying to avoid sugar, mm. you can do that with this machine. If you need to have no salt, you can do that with this machine. If you have allergies, it's perfect to know where your bread comes from. And certainly if you need to avoid gluten for whatever the reason is, it is so beautiful to have bread that is just made. Because anything that comes right out of the oven tastes more special than something that's cold. But that doesn't mean that it has to be difficult. In fact, with Wolfgang's bread maker, it's kind of the opposite. If you've been intimidated by baking, I guarantee you, if you can read, you can bake, you just don't know that you can and when you have the proper tools it's child's play to do so but let's say you didn't have the bread maker and you decide you're going to make a loaf of bread and you're going to try to knead it with your favorite wooden spoon probably your spoon's going to break because dough is heavy <laughs> yeah. it's a heavy duty item and it takes a long time to incorporate many many minutes most of us would give up before it's completely done but not with the bread maker it's got that <laughs> built-in feature where it knows exactly how long to mix yes. it for you add the ingredients press the button and you're going to come home to bread that looks mm. it has a beautiful crust to it this is on the dark setting because that's how we like it but you're going to choose the one that you like but isn't that beautiful don't you wish you were here with us because this is as good as it gets mm. <laughs> don't mm, that is so good i'm telling you what there is nothing better than homemade bread true. i don't eat bread very often because it's Can so towel? icky in the stores because it's cold and it, there's you know it's stuffed full of preservatives Forgive me for eating with my mouth full. Yeah, even the white sandwich that. bread, Kelly, at the grocery store, oh. 27 ingredients. And I can't really figure out why, because this has six. Wolfgang's Pizza Dough has six. The gluten-free has 10, and they're all as normal as water, wow. salt, butter, honey, things like that mm. that you can pronounce. It's really easy to make bread, but having an appliance like this where you dump the ingredients in, press the button, and walk away, in fact, you can hear that it's quiet. Our dough ball is perfectly mixed, but now it's going into its resting phase where the yeast is gonna be um, letting the wow. dough rise and get nice and tall before it bakes it. But we haven't touched this. Once I put the ingredients in and press those few buttons on the front, you walk away and let this go, and it does every other part for you. All the mixing, all the resting, the proofing, which is where it's rising up and getting nice and tall uh -huh. and fluffy, and then all the baking, it does it all for you. This is a huge benefit that we have Marion here to teach us about this, because she is an award-winning pastry chef. She was one of Wolfgang's best pastry chefs in an Orlando restaurant until he scooped her up and brought her here to us full time. And I'm telling you what, what a treat to learn from an expert and a master at the craft from Marion. And what you just said really struck me, Marion, because even a white bread in the grocery store has like 27 mm -hmm. ingredients in it. Whereas these ingredients mm -hmm. or these recipes have what, six? Because that's really all you need in order to make something fresh. And when it's fresh, it's just better. How many of us are throwing away those loaves of bread because they're moldy or they've been in your th in your drawer for three weeks and they still look like they're good? Ew, the reason they still look good is because they're so full of uh, chemicals and preservatives. Absolutely. Don't eat it. And you know, if you're going through a hard time in your life, which so many of us do, maybe it's a divorce, maybe it's something really difficult, sometimes the chaos in your home is just almost too much to bear and you start to think, gosh, mm. am I really gonna be able to hold it together here? Sometimes just something like calming down, making something like no, a loaf of bread, so letting your home feel good will let you have a great day and start getting back to a healthier way. It happens to all of us. Wolfgang would tell you the same thing if he was here. Sometimes when he's fighting with his kids, because raising kids isn't easy, and as no. they get older, it definitely gets more difficult. <laughs> but sometimes a little thing, it's just like, he says it best, he says it's just like music. Your Aww. favorite song can take you out of a bad day to a good day. So this was actually the little, and we made a, a seven grain bread and then one that had just five little grains mixed into a white bread oh, and kind of swirled them together. So you're gonna be able to have so much fun with this from the simplest sandwich bread all the way to the most complicated. Even like marble rye, Callie is perfect in here. But anyway, 
get it at home and start having fun with the people that you love making homemade bread. You're gonna love it because it's, it's beyond even just making bread. Don't forget, you can do your brownies and you can do your banana breads and all those specialty kinds of things. Plus your jams and jellies. I mean, look at all the things that Marion has made for us. I mean, lemon curd, look at that cherry. Cherry uh, jam, cherry absolutely. Jam. Apple, look this at This is grape apples. jelly that we made because my grandchildren love that. So the spiced apple jam, preserves, and that's Yum. perfect for gift giving too. So maybe you're gonna wrap up, True. maybe you have someone that you need to give a gift to. Maybe they've gone through a really hard time. Take them over a loaf of bread that you made yourself. They're gonna, you get all the credit for making it homemade. They just don't need to know that it was really easy to do. <laughs> and then dump the ingredients in for jam, put it in a pretty little canning jar. They're all the rage now. There's so many beautiful kinds. Add that and people are gonna think that you thought about them for hours, where in your busy life, what you really did was make a whole bunch of different gifts really, really quickly. You know, I'm equating this to like, do you know how good it feels when you get like a real hand lit written letter in the right? mail? Right, exactly, or card Kelly, from somebody exactly. instead of just bills? It's the same <laughs> kind of feeling when you have home baked bread ready to enjoy and eat or to Marion's idea to give. I mean, this is kind of going back to the old fashioned roots, I guess. I feel as a kid that grew up on a farm in North Dakota where it's, it was the simple things that made all the difference that really had an impact on me as a woman growing up and now passing on traditions to my son. Like I said, I'm not the best cook or baker something like this has made me kind of a hero in my son's eyes when a, when he comes home from school not that he does anymore because he's long gone but <laughs> seriously to walk into the house and smell homemade bread he'd be like mom I know right? you're so cool <laughs> and that's why we talk about grandma making it because grandma had more time than we do yep in the 1860s the average woman spent about 10 hours a day preparing food Cali nowadays that's dwindled down to about 23 minutes and that includes quickly pouring the cereal into the bowl in the morning <laughs> because we're so busy but here's the thing, we have such rich, full lives because of that. We're able to be busy with a fulfilling job. Our community, right. our church, our yep. children, and all the lovely <gasps> activities that they get to be in. Oh. So how in the world do you make it all fit? How do you still cook at home? How do you make homemade things, but save yourself a ton of time? You have this tricks way. like this That's up your right. sleeve. Wolfgang knows all of that, and I really think that his success here at HSN is coupled with you because you're really smart shoppers and you ask him for more, you tell him what it's your true. problems are, and he's a genius because he listens to you. And that's why I'm so proud to work for him. I'm I so know. proud that he lets me show you his wonderful products when he can't be here. It's a great point, Marion, because Wolfgang really, truly, I mean, his his level of excellence in all of his restaurants is the same level of quality he has for the products that he brings to us at HSN. So you know what? You can go buy any old bre bread maker. You can go buy some cheap thing at the grocery store and have no idea who made it, and you'll be disappointed, and you'll probably spend about this much money, I say go with a trusted name like Wolfgang Puck. He's been with us now, is it 18 years? 1998, 19. whatever that is, okay. right? Wow, yeah, that, that's 19, <laughs> Yeah, I've been here 18. Wow. Um, no, it's, it's really amazing what he what he does. He brings amazing product, and he has such a passion for wanting all of us at home to be able to still enjoy the same kind of high quality cooking, even if we don't think we're good cooks like he is. Well, he was chefs. once not a good cook, and he always says that, and we start at the beginning, and that's why something that offers you that hand up, like a bread maker, is so great. Exactly. Because it's easy, all the products we've had today have been really easy easy where it's a, a beginner level cook. Yes. You read the instructions. It tells you a cup of flour, you dump it in the pan. Follow yeah. it on down, press the button, and you're going to walk in and go, oh, I cannot believe I, I did that. Your family is going to say, oh my gosh, how did Wouldn't you do that? would this be a great gift for like a new bride? Mm -hmm. Somebody who's Absolutely. like scared to death because she has no idea how to cook, but it's an expectation. <laughs> <laughs> a home bake, you know, loaf of bread goes a long way, I'm telling you. Um, we are heading off to the phones. As you're ordering, it's 288-613. We are busy. It's always at the end of the presentation. It gets crazy around here. I, know, right? I don't want you to wait on this one because when this comes back in stock, because it's going to sell out at this price, it's going to be $40 more to get the same machine. So get it today as we say hi to Zaina on the phones from Illinois. Hi. Do you have it, Zaina? Zaina, are you with us? Don't be shy. I think you own this already. Do you? Okay. We're going to check on connection. But I think Zaina owns it and loves it. It's one of those things that like we always want one. Don't just go get an ordinary old bread maker from somebody else. Get Wolfgang's. It's one touch. Don't forget, there's keep warm mode for an hour. There's a 13 hour delay start mode. And you've got every possible combination of ingredients to be able to make your very own favorite breads. Especially if you wanna do gluten free because that is a big craze right now and super, super healthy uh, and a health initiative for a lot of us. I think we did reconnect with Zaina. Oh good. Are you there Zaina? Yes, I am. Awesome. Hi. Thank you? you. We are wonderful. We appreciate you calling. Tell us if you already own it, I understand. 
I, I have one, and I just picked another one for my daughter. She is uh, a baker. She just uh, graduated from baking class, and now she was using my uh, bread maker for a long time, and I just said, now it's the time to get her another one. So I was just uh, searching through the channel, and I just saw this, and it's the most amazing thing I've Aww. ever purchased. It's like the unit of most valuable like when you purchase it. So it's easy for you and you're happy with the way things turn out? Oh, yeah, yes. Yeah. It, 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 if anyone buys it, they're going to be so happy that they purchased it. I totally agree with you. I'm so glad. And you love it enough that you bought one for your daughter and you did it at the right time. Zaina's saving another $40. We appreciate your phone call. Thank you yeah. very much. Thank, Thank you, you so much. So much. It is such a treat to be able to get something like this delivered to your door. Keep in mind, it'll be delivered in a couple of days. That flex pay, that's not like a layaway plan. It's not $19.99 to get this delivered to your door Crazy, today. right? I love that. You'll have it in a couple of days, and then next month it's $19.99. You just pay a little at a time. I think it's dropping in some of its uh I know, the pecans, pecans just went in, huh? Yeah. So it's gonna slowly kind of just fold those in. And if you are just tuning in, guys, take advantage of this. The bread maker from Wolfgang Puck giving you a huge array of options of different types of breads that you can make at home from scratch. Natural, whole, raw, real ingredients, not a bunch of chemicals and preservatives and, and words you can't even begin to pronounce because they're 12 letters long. Don't eat that. It's gonna, it's like pay now or pay later. I say eat healthy now and enjoy the real taste of real food. Look at that, now what's that last loaf? So this is 100% whole wheat, just plain. And you can do this, and if you've had bread makers